Welcome back to the channel. My name is Abel and welcome back to Uncharted 3 Drake's Deception. Last time we made our way to the Yemen and we, in a, in a bittersweet kind of way, reunited with Elena Fisher who got us into Yemen and gave us, you know, some some passes pretty much to, to get us through sort of some checkpoints and allow, allow us into Yemen basically um, quite safely. Um, so Elena and Drake uh, were married, yeah, it's of course set two years after the end of Uncharted 2 where they seem to start a relationship. They have since married and separated. Elena is still wearing a wedding ring, Drake is not. And Sully is kind of the third wheel in all this. Uh, so yeah, we're in Yemen and we managed to find uh, this room here which gave us like a star map which will hopefully allow us to find the location of Ubar in the desert. Um, so we have uh, hopefully found where that location is. Um, but we've also found that um, Drake left here. Drake turned back. Francis Drake, this is. Uh, left these messages as, I guess, like a warning. And he just completely aborted the mission. Although Drake's going to keep going. And that is why Elena and Drake broke up. Is that Drake was, you know, quite a, a, obsessed with, you know, following uh, Francis Drake's legacy. And was also afraid to basically commit to Elena. Despite the fact they married, he just didn't want to commit to a normal life. And that is why they broke up. That's why they split up. Oh, we're back in this room again. Take cover, it's an ambush. Oh, hello. Oh, I saw a smoke Elena, one. Sully, get down. Right, we've still got the shotgun, so that's good. Right, this is going to be tough. Right. Well, we'll have that. Oh, get off me! Get off me! Oh, okay. I'm trying to shoot him, but I don't. I, I don't know that you can actually shoot those guys. If you can, it's probably very difficult. Right, let's try this again. Incoming! I can't see a thing! Oh. Sully, you alright? Yeah! There's a guy there that we Sully, need to get rid of. Damn, I can't see a thing! Oh, that's a lane. I'm shooting the laner. Sorry. Oh! Right, that shotgun guy needs to go, but this guy also needs to go. Oh god, that was tough. I was being like double team there and Drake and Elena were no help. Right, that's the shotgun guy dealt with. Uh, right, where's this massive guy? Here he is. Right, we're gonna deal with this guy now. Come on. I think this might be the last one though. I don't think there's any more enemies. So if we can just deal with this guy, we should be good. Let's kick him in the nads two or three times. I saw Elena running around in the background. Hopefully there's no more bad guys. Again, in the nads. There we go. A knee to the head. And that's done. Let's go for the power. We've got lots of shotgun shells. That's good news. What else have we got? Oh, hello. Oh, 
Oh god, there's more. There we go. Any more? You see any more? We gotta no, find I think a way we're out. Good. And how are we gonna do that? Over here, Nate. I'll give you a leg up. Yeah, in a minute. I just wanna. Well, we've got another shotgun there. The sword off ones. I think we'll probably lose, and we'll we'll, we'll stick with this Saz shotgun. It's not the Sus shotgun. Uh, and I will go for the R micro. I think. Right. Uh, I think we've got all the guns we can. Right, let's jump up then. Let's try and work out how... Oh, we jump behind. Ahead. There we go. Alright, watch it. I'm going to send the ladder down. Hey, right. heads up. Right, Got let's it. get out of here. Anyone else here or will be good? I think it was only those few people. Thanks. Surprised they didn't leave nice. anyone else up here. On the street. Uh, right. Much as I'd like to. Right, we're back to being unarmed once okay. again. I think we're clear. Come on. Right, let's get out of here. Make I'm amazed they didn't leave anyone else up here. Uh, but I guess if you can't have guns, then there wouldn't be a need to have any. Hello, treasure. I'll join you guys in a minute. I'm just getting this treasure. We've found like eight treasures in Yemen, which is really, really good for me. Um, it's another necklace, an Amazonite and Amber necklace. Right. Right, we're going to find where they went. Oh, there's another one. I was doing so well with these treasures. What is that? Oh, a silver capsule pendant. Okay. Where do they go? Oh, they're over there. All right. Is that way. another one? This way. Oh my god. An earring. Amazon and Amber again. Oh god. Did they just shoot us with what they shot Cutter with? They just shot us with the same dart they shot Carter right, with. Stay away. Stay away. What's wrong? We're not going to start beating Sully up, or are we? Come on, we got to get him out of here. Come on, stop. Touch me. All right. Yeah. We just, we just want to help. Get away. Get away from me. We just took a swing at Elena. Right. Brace yourself with trippy shit. This is really cool. Get away from me. Wait, it's a bit now. silly, but it's like interesting. Oh god. Oh god. Stay calm. God, like Talbot's in our head. Come with me. Oh, don't, this don't is weird. And I don't like it, but at the same time I do. Marlo's waiting. Marlo is here then. No, no, no. Because this is what Cutter was thinking, well, sort of behaving like. Carter must have been experiencing this same thing. Relax. Trust me. I'm sorry. Right, let's get out of here. Shh. Sully? Sully's not here, Track. You're on your own now. Trust us. Follow this way. me. I don't know where you are. No. You're in my head, but go. you're you're not here. Don't resist. Where is this? You're with us. Come on, let me through. Just listen to me. You know what we want. Don't let, don't let, don't let. No, I can't go that way. Yeah. 
Where is it? I don't know. Give them to us. Give them to us? I don't know. What? I don't know. I don't know. Good. I don't know. I don't know. Please. I don't know. Do, do you know what this action did to remind me of? Ethan in heavy rain with the claustrophobia or the agoraphobia. Oh, it's you. Welcome back. Helen Mirren. Sorry, B Tech Helen Mirren. And there's Talbot. And random guy. I don't recommend making a scene. You're not exactly here legally, remember? Well, are you are you? Greatness from small beginnings. Beneath that cocky exterior, you're still the same scared, filthy little runaway, aren't you? Skip the mind games. You don't know me. In fact, I suspect I know you better than anyone, Mr. Drake. Of course, that's not your real name, is it? But we won't dwell on that. Mother commits suicide. Father surrenders son to the state at the age of five. Entrusted to the St. Francis Boys Home. <laughs> it's also Dickensian. <laughs> oh. Don't worry. She's of no interest to us. Good, leave her out of it. Unless, of course, we need to apply a little pressure. What do you want from me? Well, as much as it pains me to admit it, I need your help to find Victor Sullivan. Right. We already know he has the coordinates to find Iran. How do you know that? <laughs> you told us, Nathan. It seems your loyalty isn't as firm as you'd like to think it is. Well, we're drugged, weren't we? What about his? What? Wait. What are you trying to pull? Nothing. It's just that, well, we've had you in our clutches for quite some time now. And he hasn't exactly mounted a rescue. He didn't rescue you back in Cartagena either. Cartagena, speak Spanish properly, woman. Exploit. I know what you're trying to do. Trust me. Victor is only ever in it for Victor. It's a cold, hard fact. I discovered it 20 years ago. I'm surprised it's taken you this long to figure it out. You're wasting your time, lady. Fair enough. But ask yourself. When he scooped you off the streets of Colombia 20 years ago, did he save you from that life? Or did he just doom you to this one? We were already part of that life. Excellent. But we were already following Drake's well, footsteps even before we met Sully. Sullivan on the other side of the city. I'm sorry, Nathan. It seems you've been removed from the equation. <laughs> All right, we're going off to Talbot then, again. Well, <laughs> if we can c catch up with him, that is. Yeah, Marlo's clearly trying to drive a wedge between us and Sully. That's like, obviously happening. And, you know, if Drake did say, you know, that Sully knows where Aram is, like, because he was drugged. And when Carter was drugged, he handed stuff over. He handed his gun over, he handed the journal over. That's what happens when they drug you. It's like, they're like coercing you. Ow! Ow! So I guess that's what happens. Either that, or they're just bluffing and they don't know that Sully knows where Aram is. 
Right. Uh, God, he's a he's a quick little bugger, is that Talbot, isn't he? Uh, okay, we're going that way. We'll go this way instead, then. Just can't catch him. It's like this guy's been watching too much Assassin's Creed. <laughs> like, obviously, look at him. He thinks he's Altair or Ezio or whichever Creed game you played. Ow, <laughs> my back! Oh, oh, what? Ow! <laughs> We got caught by the cops, the, the Yemen cops. We ain't got a gun on us, though. We can't really do anything about that. All right, avo avoid the police, I guess. Talbot does just not get tired, does he? I mean, Carter shot him in the chest and it didn't even phase him. Don't get hit by the bus. Uh, where am I going? Oh, up here. Oh, get away from the police again. Oh, we're in the hotel again. Oh, we almost got him. There we go. Oh, and he's still... Right, okay, again, that didn't even phase him. Get away from the police. God, he's trying to catch him up again here. He's getting away pretty quickly, though. He just does not stop. I'm right, going that way. In this case, we will go this way. Damn it. Surprise, asshole. <laughs> Surprise, motherfucker. Come on. Slow down. Jesus Christ. Get tired. Ow. Shit. <laughs> Mate, you're going in circles. Still chasing Arthur. Him. Like, are you ever going to stop running? He's getting far. I swear he's getting faster. Like, slow down. How are you so quick? I mean, you must be taking a different kind of drug. You're taking PEDs. Uh, oh, I lost him. Here we go. Yeah, he is, he is up and gone. He has fully vanished. We've lost him. <laughs> no, he's there. Come on, look for the balloon. Look for the kip of the balloon. Jason! Jason! Where are you? Where's he gone? Pardon me. Excuse me. Is he down here? There he is. Ah. didn't you? Oh, God, to jump. Right, he's gone into that building. Right, we need to just keep an eye on him. I can already tell that's going to cave in. There we go. I knew that was going to happen. Come on, Talbot. This is getting old. Oh, we're going to police again. Oh, they're shooting at us. Still jumping across the rooftops. Mate, you're coming into a dead end. Or not. Oh, God, I almost pressed the wrong button there. It used to be triangle to zip line. Oh, right, okay. We've got some fight in now. Oh, right in the face. Can we hit him with a that? Oh, where are we going? Oh, God, we're going to the water. Don't drown us. Come on. Come on. There we go. Don't get drowned. Doing his best Sean Bean impression there, calling me a bastard. Come on. Ow. Ow. 
الفلافل والحمص والبابغا النوم ريمبر مي رامسيس يو شود ثانك مي ماي فريند Welcome to the filler story, everyone. Uh, yeah, I don't know what went on in three with this, but we'll crack on. Uh, right. Thanks. No, really. The English lady paid me to get rid of you. But me, I'm a nice guy. I saved your life. Right now, I am the only friend you got. Now you figure I owe you something. Is that it? Smart guy. I like that. You are way ahead of me. It is really a simple question. Aram of the pillars. <sighs> of course. Where is it? I don't know, buddy. Bullshit. Look, even if I did know, my life wouldn't be worth very much once I told you. Now would it? You insult me. You're a pirate. And a good businessman. You are a pirate. Give me some respect. Let's try this again. Where is Aram, Nathan? Look, you can torture me all you want. Okay. But I can't tell you what I don't know. Maybe so. We'll see if your friend is more cooperative. What? Who? Your friend, Victor Sullivan. I don't want to do this. At his age, it may be too much for him. Wait. No, no, no. You have given me no choice. Perhaps your friend will be more grateful for his life. Wait. Leave Sully alone! By Nathan! You don't touch him! <laughs> this is gonna be fun! Okay! Chapter 12 Abducted. Don't want to tell us what we want to know, huh? I'm talking to you, boy! Oh, let's headbutt him. Right, we are free. Right, let's see how we do here then. Get rid of you. Come on. Come on, one of those bottles. Oh! A massive wrench. God, this is like 5v1 at the moment. Into the box. Get the guy with the mask. I'll try her to at least. Oh. Oh, that big hammer. Oh, the bottle. That'll do. Let's use that hammer. Oh! <laughs> this is cool. I love using the environment. I like that about three. I don't like this story though. This is just filler for Uncharted 3. It's like they, they sort of thought, oh, this game's not quite as long as I would have liked. So they decided to do a whole thing with a pirate. And the thing is, again, it's a, an environment that's different for Uncharted, but it's, it just feels like filler story. Oh, okay, this guy's a big deal. Shit, where did you come from? Uh, from up on those uh, cargo crates. Drake, are you not watching? Oh, get rid of him. Move. And again. Okay. Right, that's you dealt with. I think we are there. And stay down. Please. Please. 
Yeah. Um, this whole thing with Ramses, who's uh, basically a pirate slash bounty hunter, uh, does feel a bit like filler for three. Hello, mice. Rum. How cliche. Well, the, the rum isn't gone. The rum isn't gone. I can see a treasure over there. Couldn't quite. Well, can't quite reach it though. There must be another way over there. Uh, oh, I think it's up here. Yeah. That's how we get across. So yeah, I, I'm, I'm not saying this is like a bad part of the game. It just does feel like filler. Like they, they, the game wasn't as long as they would have liked. So they decided to add a little bit with the pirates. Just to, to make the game a bit longer. But again, it gives it another new sort of environment. You know, I said last time, we've had London, we've had Syria, we've had France and Yemen. And now we've got like this sort of... Um, cargo ship that we seem to be on. Ramses is like the uh, the Eddie Raja of Uncharted 3. Like Uncharted 2 didn't really have like a villain like that, like a, a, a sub villain I guess you could guess. Like a Yeah. Like a, a a sort of secondary antagonist, I think. Although that's probably Talbot. Marlowe's the main antagonist, and Talbot is the secondary antagonist. So, what does that make Ramses? A tertiary antagonist? I guess that does. Uh, how do we. Ah. There we go. Right, we want to jump across to there. There we go. Right now we're talking. Empty. Yep, no gun. Of course it's empty. No gun for Drake. Right, so Sully is apparently here somewhere. Somewhere on this cargo ship. There's another treasure. What is that? A figure amulet. Okay. How long have we been going? About half an hour. I'll try and find a place to stop, I think. Before we get to this whole subplot thing with Ramses. Oh, crap. Um, this might be a good place, actually. This is where we are. This doesn't look like Yemen, does it? <laughs> it probably still is Yemen. We're probably just out in the harbour, but yeah. Uh, look at this place. This is where we are. Shit. Here goes nothing. Right, so we're going to try and get out of here. Um, I I think we're probably going to get anything here. I know we're probably at about half an hour, but I think this is going to be a slightly shorter one. Um, yeah, we need to find Sully. Apparently Sully's here somewhere. Ramses probably owns a boat around here somewhere. Probably that one over there. Who knows? But yeah, Ramses around here somewhere. And we need to get Sully back and then get back to finding a Ram find out what happened to Elena, because we have no idea where she is. We haven't heard anything from Elena. Uh, hopefully they're okay, but if Drake's told Marlo where they are, they might be in big trouble, both of them. But, um, we'll find that next time. For now, thank you for watching. If you enjoyed the video, drop a like down below and leave comments. And if you haven't done so already, or if you're new, then subscribe and turn notifications on. Um, yeah, like I said, this does feel a bit like filler for Uncharted 3. It's not terrible, but just doesn't, but just sort of Ramses isn't a great villain, really. He has a very small part in this game. He's he's not a terrible bad guy, but this does just feel like filler. This um, next sort of an hour or so, I'm not quite sure. But we're going to pick things up next time. Try and find Sully. But for now, thank you for watching. I'll see you soon. Goodbye.